fight between Miata and Runesack has been carried over for a judge's decision. Both boxers put up an impressive fight, giving it all they had to the bitter end. The crowd is silent as the referee prepares to announce the result. It's a draw! Huh? You've got to be kidding! What the hell were the judges watching? He knocked him down twice, and not one point was scored against him in the entire match. Was there somebody we were supposed to Quit pay off? Mention. He said it huh? was a draw! Hometown decision. You have to expect it from time to time when you enter foreign terrain. Japan is no different. Yeah, but that's not fair. This was supposed to be Miyata's comeback match after the Mashaba fight. He takes down a fifth ranker with a brilliant KO. And I come all the way to Thailand to tie with some fighter nobody's ever heard of. My career started out strong. I made my debut as a so-called prodigy. So what in the world am I doing wrong? <laughs> We've been here for about two months now. Took me that long just to tolerate the food. But I don't think I'll ever get used to this heat. I'm kind of surprised to see so many Japanese people. Although most of them are tourists. Seems like a lot of them are Ichiro's age. He's sweating plenty in this heat. But unfortunately his weight control is not as successful. There's plenty of featherweight boxers Ichiro's height. But they don't have big bones like he does. A build like his makes him much better suited to be a lightweight boxer. To make the weight, he has to sacrifice a lot of things that your average teenager would enjoy. What a completely different life he's leading compared to other young people his age. It's got to be tough. I hate to say it, but at 18, he willingly gave up his right to be young. Now that I think about it, I can't even remember the last time I saw him smile. We just got the application for the next match, but... Here, take a look. Jimmy Sisfar. Ten matches, ten wins, ten KOs. Jimmy Sisfar? I have heard of him, actually. He's making quite a name for himself in Southeast Asia. That's right. He's called Jimmy the Kid. Before he took on boxing, he was a successful Muay Thai champion with 32 consecutive KOs. He's practically a superstar. The people around here idolize him. So why would somebody like that want to challenge Ichiro? Huh? Because he thinks that it'll just be another easy win so he can build up his record. You're kidding. How do you think we should handle this? I'm wondering the same thing, because it's Ichiro who really needs a win right now. have something to say, I suggest you say it out loud. All this whispering is making me nervous. <sighs> They're just not getting it. Hey, Payo, you know how to speak a little Japanese, don't you? <clears throat> what are they saying? They're saying that the Japanese boy is not very hungry. Hmm? The people of Thailand would never pass up a chance to win big money against a strong opponent. They are saying that you are running away. Running? From what? Jimmy's a real powerful boxer. I don't think you are running. I think you made a good decision not to fight him. Huh? Why didn't you tell me? It'll be all right, son. From here on out, we'll have you box Junior Light. Junior Light? It'll be a lot easier to make the weight, and you could take full advantage of your speed and power. There's no reason to hold on to featherweight. But I want to hold on. When I started out in boxing, I had absolutely no worries or doubts. My mental vision was clear. The only thing I saw was a straight path to the world title. But one day, Ippo came in and stood in my way on that path. If I avoid the roadblock now, I'll probably do that for the rest of my career. If I take the easy way out, all I'll be doing is taking a detour to my goal. I know all about Jimmy Sisfar. And I know that right now, he's a better fighter than I am. And it's possible that I can't beat him. 
But that doesn't mean that I'm supposed to run from him. If I don't face up to him, I won't be able to become a world champion. I can't run away. I understand what you're saying, but it's not going to happen. Why not? I'm afraid he's simply at too high a level. Hey, you always told me that boxing is unpredictable, Dad. So why do you think that I have absolutely no chance of winning? You're being set up to be the loser. That's why, as your father, I... I only want your opinion as my trainer. Then here it is. Your counterpunch, the most effective weapon you have, will not work against him. I realized something back when you fought Mashiba. Your punches are sharp. At the time, I was pretty sure that they were powerful enough to take out practically any opponent with one blow. But there's a problem. Your punches are light. Your punches cut quick, but they also heal quick. For the average fighter, you'd be able to land enough punches to wear him down. But without raw power, the chances of you putting a hurt on someone like Jimmy are slim to none. The nature of your punch is something you're born with. We can't train our way out of this. He is a seasoned Muay Thai champion with 32 consecutive wins under his belt. And it's going to take a lot more than a couple of your counter punches to make him fall. I already know this. I've been fighting long enough to know all my own weaknesses. But Dad, if I can't rely on my own fists, what else do I have? If I begin to believe that my ability is limited, then I can't fight any longer. I don't care what you say. I'm fighting him. It would seem that history repeats itself. Huh? It happened to me exactly the same way. When I began to realize my own limitations, it was pride that kept me from stepping back into that ring. He might be feeling the same way. You think he's been cornered that badly? Damn! He's going through sparring partners like tissue paper. I bet it's getting harder all the time for Jimmy's manager to find someone crazy enough to even be a sparring partner. You probably already heard that we just found a fighter from Japan to accept the match. How about anything you're talking about, Miata? We know all about Jimmy's upcoming opponent. As a kickboxer, he easily proved himself to be the strongest of the lot. At the height of his career, he switched to boxing to gain worldwide recognition. And I'm confident that the upcoming match will serve as a nice stepping stone toward that goal. My counterpunch won't work on him. My speed will. I'll hit him with speed and combinations and throw out the most punches. Even if it came to a decision, I could win on points alone. <sighs> Idiot! It's never going to come down to points. The only way to win is by KO. But how? What can I do for you? Hmm? Just that... Your shadow boxing is so quick and fluid that I was interested to watch you. I've watched many boxers, but I never saw somebody throw so many punches I couldn't see. Sharp like a knife. Hmm. You look very sad. Did I say something wrong? Not really. It's all right. I would bet you anything that Jimmy stuttered out in a place just like this. He is a great inspiration to many of the children here. They all believe that if they try hard, they can be just like him. That's great. Even the kids like him. Never felt more like the bad guy than when I came here. You're not a bad guy. I will root for you to win. And I believe you already have a fan. A fan? Hmm? Huh? Hey, what can I do for you, kid? Uh... Hello, sir. Hmm? So you speak Japanese? Shana, this is my brother. He's a real boxing fan. He's been watching your moves even more than I have. Go ahead, tell him what you said to me earlier. Mm. Talk to him! No wonder the kids bully you when you can't speak your mind. Well, would you believe? It reminds me of a friend I have back in Japan. 
And I really hate him. Well, not him really, but how powerful he is. You know you could be strong too if you really try. I wish. Huh? When I grow up, I want to be a professional boxer just like you. In Thailand, most of the kids want to be like Jimmy. They think kickboxing is a cooler sport. But me? I want to box and be able to throw counter punches just as good as you. He was watching your last fight when he turned into your greatest fan for all time. Please, it'd really mean a lot to me if you could show me all those killer counter punches. I'm sorry, Chana. There's nothing special about my counter punches. If there was, then there wouldn't be anything to worry about. I could fight him right now. The truth is, right now I don't have any solid punches that can knock him out. But that doesn't mean that I couldn't come up with one. Was I so full of myself to think that my counter punches were absolutely perfect and couldn't be improved? But I still have some time. And there's always room for improvement. I can develop a punch so solid that if I were to land it, it would mean an assured knockout. Sharp and heavy. A counter punch to end all counter punches. A counter punch to end all counter punches. His finishing move is a hook while he's in fighting, no exceptions. He's an orthodox fighter, never been knocked down. It's obvious that Jimmy will be a powerful opponent. Are you listening? Sir? Huh? Yeah. By the way, have you seen Ichiro? Inasana. <gasps> He's been there the whole time? Uh, uh, oh, uh. no. Ichiro! Come on, wake up! Ichiro! I'm a little thirsty. I have a feeling he doesn't even realize he passed out. How far do I have to go? He doesn't eat, doesn't drink. He sweats it out every chance he gets, but he can't seem to lose the weight. He can't hack it for 10 rounds, so his only hope is to go for an early KO. Oh, but how can he do it if none of his counter punches have the strength to make it happen? If he gets sick, he won't be able to fight. All right, this is my very first monsoon. I hope I can get this umbrella to him in time. Oh, man, I'm totally soaked. You should strip back down to your swimsuit. Oh, I'm sure you'd love that, wouldn't you? Come on, let's hit oh. it. <laughs> Wait up, you guys. Huh? <laughs> What are you doing here? You came out here in the rain for me? Uh, yeah. I wanted you to have this umbrella. It's a nice thought. But I don't think that an umbrella is going to make me any drier. Yeah, I guess not. Did you go? You don't ever smile, do you? The Japanese, they come to Thailand to have fun. But in all the time I've watched you, you've never smiled once. The guys at the gym say you'll never beat Jimmy because you're Japanese. They say you're not hungry enough. But that can't be true. You never eat. I don't see you drink water. You're hungrier than they are. You gotta be one of the hungriest people I've ever met. Thai boxers get into the ring because they want to make money. I can tell that you don't care about the money. So I just don't get it. You don't look like you're having any fun. Why do you get in the ring if it makes you suffer? I just don't understand it. Why do you box? Sorry, I don't mean to ramble. Um, I just hate to see you so sad. You're not angry, are you? 
Let's go home. You could get really sick out here. Thanks, Chana. Uh... I don't smile, huh? You're right about that. I don't know a single person who would agree with me, but... I believe that a boxer has to earn his right to smile. And when he does, it's something that only a boxer could experience. I know it sounds crazy, but that's the way I feel. I guess so. You wanted to see me perform some killer counterpunches, right? Uh, uh-huh. Well, maybe you'll get your chance. He's losing his stamina. Miata's starting to box like he's been glued to the mat, and we're only days away from the fight. He's actually getting worse the closer we get. I'm not finished yet, Payal. I want to keep fighting. Yeah, don't you think you're pushing too hard? Keep fighting! Use your counter! Oh no, he should have been able to counter that punch! Ah, Miata's just charging into him head first. We gotta stop him. He's doing lousy out there. Strange. He's tired and hurting, but he still has incredible speed. Just look at him. Even his pacing is lousy. I can't watch this anymore. I'm gonna put a stop to it, all right? Oh! That's enough! Stop the match! Hey, wow, Ichiro, you doing okay? You all right? Uh, what's wrong with me? He barely got out any clean hits, but something he did took a lot out of me. His punches, they're different somehow. But what is he doing different? Uh, He's gotten one step closer to pulling it off. One step closer to developing the counter to surpass all counters. I'm almost there. Almost there. Well, the good news is, is that you made weight. And the bad news is that Jimmy's in peak physical condition, with all the healthy flush and glow of a newborn baby. Mm -hmm. Huh? Hmm. No. Looks like he's a little nervous, but can't really blame him. Oh, damn it! Oh, I'm pathetic! I can't even tie my damn shoelaces. I put up a front and left Japan, and I've got nothing to show for it except all my weaknesses. They're betting 30 to 1 against me. How many boxers had to fight all the way through those kinds of odds? They all expect me to be just another loser that Jimmy brushes aside on his way to glory. And now I'm just falling apart. Damn it! There's no use worrying about it. Just suck it up and stop whining about it. I forgot. I completely forgot. I know a boxer who's fought against odds like this again and again. And that didn't stop him. Is this what he always went through? Is this the kind of pressure he felt even before he stepped into the ring? How did he make it work for him? How did he do it? How did he always find a way to win? Let's go! Get a move on! We're gonna miss the fight! I couldn't help it! I had to work! Bio! Ichiro is gonna win, isn't he? Isn't he? I don't know. Jimmy's a real powerful boxer. It's gonna be awfully <laughs> tough. But there's hope. Ichiro's last counterpunches look different somehow. Huh? Shana? 
I thought you believed in him. Whose side are you on? Huh? Come on, I'm on his side, of course. Do you mean it? I can even prove it. Huh? Truth is, I believe in him so much, I bet this month's entire living expenses on him. <laughs> We're gonna cheer for him with all our hearts. Yeah! Listen, it's all about Jimmy. Talk about a hometown advantage. Even if there were a few people up there cheering for me, it wouldn't make any difference. Jimmy's got the eye of the tiger. I can tell just by looking at him that he's as powerful as they say. All right, listen up. I want you to go out there and just observe him. Pay special attention to his left-right hooks. Huh? That crowd out there came here for one reason, to watch Jimmy win. You don't mean that. It's not just my opinion. That's what 30 to 1 odds are about. Uh, Still, if our newly improved counter connects just right, even the mighty Jimmy Sisfar will fall flat on the mat. Unfortunately, there are no guarantees. The better he makes his counter punch, the more risk he also takes. I'm sure he's fully aware of that, too. And now for the moment of truth. Here comes the long-awaited opening bell. Right now, the fight has begun. Oh, huh? right, they're still fighting. We made it in time. What do you see? How's he doing out there? Hey, Ichido! Uh It's been Jimmy all the way so far. Oh. He's proven how tough he really is. Has Miata hit the wall? <laughs> It's awful. Miata's helplessly locked in a defensive mode. Jimmy smells blood and presses his attack. He's relentless. He's on the rampage. Go! Oh, I'll kill her right! Oh, Miata's on the map. He somehow far. managed to defend himself up to round three, but finally he's fallen. What a great effect on you, the unbelievable Jimmy. Keep it up. What a spectacular show of power. Jimmy rules the ring. Can Miata get back up? I can't believe it. I thought it was going to be a great matchup. Nothing like this. I didn't know Jimmy was that tough. Ichiro, get up. You got to try. Three. He's got to give up. Put the nail in his Four. coffin, Jimmy. Damn. This is pathetic. I keep fighting in my own style like I'm sentimentally attached to it or something. Five. Miyama's back on his feet. But can he keep fighting? Six. Anyway, my old style has Seven. no effect on him. This guy's ridiculously strong. But now that I've learned that my style's no good, Eight. I'm ready to move on. 20 seconds remain in round three. Can Jimmy finish him off in time? Go, Jimmy! Dig him a grave Go while you're at it! Box! Good going. Look at that, he's changed his whole style. You're right. Watch this, he's going to use the jolt finally. Huh? If he can put his full weight onto his front foot, when he steps forward to throw the punch, he can put his entire body into it. It'll compensate for the lightness of the punch and produce awesome destructive power. The concept is good, but isn't that sort of... Risky? Absolutely. If his timing's off, that destructive power will be flung back in his face. The force of his counter might end up transferred to Jimmy, adding to his already tremendous power. And that would seriously shorten the lifespan of my son's boxing career. There's no way of knowing what's going to happen. But either way, it won't be pretty. You're going down, Sisfar. I'm not going out like this. This guy's taking an infighter's stance. Does he think he can duke it out with me? I'll make him wish he never came here. Whoa! Jimmy charges in for the attack! Yeah, he's gonna punch him out of the ring with one killer blow! Pull that sucker out of his misery! He set him up for a right hook. He's going for the jolt! Do it!
down. Miata took the full on brunt of Jimmy's right, and now he's down for the second time. <sighs> One. The count has now begun. Two. Hey, are you all right? Can you hear me, Ichiro? Talk to us. Please say anything. Three. Miata doesn't even twitch. Is this the decisive knockdown? Six. He's got a concussion. He could be seriously hurt. <sighs> I'm gonna throw in the towel. Not yet. Huh? Are you out of your mind? He can't fight anymore. <sighs> Miata! My son, have you taken your career as far as it will go? Are you going to be broken by the jolt like I was? This is awful. Just like you, Daddy! I can't run away! But there's a problem, son. Your punches are light. Light? No, you're wrong. Dad, you're awesome. There's nothing wrong with your style. Nothing at all. My goal was to work myself relentlessly every day until I'd mastered something. So you see what I'm saying? No matter who my opponent is, I'll challenge him fair and square. I'm going straight to the top. If I begin to believe that my ability is limited, then I won't be able to box anymore. I'm going to scale that wall. The wall that was too high for Dad. I'm going to scale it for his sake. But above all, for my sake. <gasps> Seven! Everything. How is that possible? I felt how hard I hit him. It was almost lethal. He looks disoriented. I don't think he can go on. Ah, wait, Miata. Back in your corner. Huh. Fight! Wow, the referee's not stopping him. The match continues. No, it doesn't! That's the bell! Round three is over! Miata, clinging by a thread, is saved by the Hold bell! On. There you go. Good work getting back on your feet. Oh, eat it all! What a relief. You could have been damaged a whole lot more after missing that jolt counter. And you only dodged that bullet because your step in was slightly too shallow. Anyway, you can't go on like this. You must find a way to strengthen your guard. What's the matter? Can't you hear what I'm saying? I can hear you, Dad, just fine. I can even hear the rain outside. Don't be silly. How can you hear rain above the crowd? <gasps> it's raining. I hear it coming down. Did he damage an eardrum? He's only semi-conscious. And why wouldn't he be? He hit the back of his head on the rope. He can't possibly fight with all this major damage. This looks very serious. We should get your son to a hospital and see a doctor as soon as we can. He's at the end of his line. Ichiro. Listen to me, son. Your idea of applying a jolt to your counter is pretty good. But you'll still see too many of his punches if you don't modify your approach. Huh? Just dive in time to his punches. Don't worry about the follow-up, okay? Keep in mind, this is a single punch strategy. That's all there is to it. If you hit him, he will fall. That's another good thing about that miss. You got a chance to see his timing firsthand. Now listen, because this is the key. There are two factors to perfecting this counter. You gotta have timing... ...and heart. <laughs> Oh, this is insane! All right, now get in there and fight. Show everybody here what you're made of. Hit him with everything you've got! 
He's really something, isn't he? We weren't inclined to believe the Japanese boxers aren't that hungry, but it looks like we were quite mistaken. That's for sure. In all my fights, I've never met an opponent with that much fighting spirit, that much sheer desire to win. You gotta show him respect at the very least. That's true. And I'll do just that by finishing him off in the next round. Round four. Jimmy looks well in command as he strolls from his corner. Will he finish the job in this round? Get it done, Jimmy! We want to cash in yeah. our bets! Even if we'll only make some chump change! It's enough for fear! Why don't you stop him? Any more punishment than this will be life-threatening. It's too risky. It's not worth it. And I can't believe you told him to use that crazy counter again. Hmm. Did you hear me? Just be quiet and you might learn something. Huh? <laughs> A long time ago, when I was the Pacific Asian reigning champ, I used that very same jolt counter on one fateful occasion. What? Well, to be accurate, I didn't use it. I couldn't. I tried, but I failed. <coughs> so you see, this new counter he came up with isn't new. It's the same dangerous punch that prematurely ended my career as a boxer. When it happened, he was ringside watching from start to finish. He saw my jaw being shattered and watched as I hit the mat in a bloody mess. It's just so ironic. He found himself facing the same wall, and he came up with the same answer. And as fate would have it, now it's my turn to watch. All right, knock him out! We want a KO! <laughs> It does look bad. He's got all that damage, so he's not able to dodge. But still, his intuition's amazing. Despite everything, he's still dodging Jimmy's power blows. What's wrong, Jimmy? Can't hit straight anymore? Damn! No! The timing's not right. I can't follow his punches with my eyes. I have to react the moment they're thrown. He can still dodge with his upper body in that condition? If that's the case... You're mine! That hurt! Miata staggers into the ropes! Will Jimmy finish him off now? Lock him down! Send him packing! The rain is turning into a downpour. It's a squall. All my limbs have gotten so heavy. It's so hard to move. You don't ever smile, do you? <laughs> Why do you get in the ring if it makes you suffer? <laughs> you don't look like you're having any fun. I just don't understand it. Why do you box? <laughs> Why do I box? <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy throws a left. Miata dodges. <laughs> Miata answers with an uppercut. Damn. Whoops. Miata gets caught in his own momentum and loses his balance. <laughs> oh. This is not good. No. Look at his stance. Son, that counter was outstanding. Great job. <laughs> One, two. I still hear the rain. <laughs> There's no way he can get up. The angle, the timing, the impact, 
Everything was perfect. He can't possibly get up. I laid everything I had on the line. The rest of my career as a boxer. I gambled it all. On that one punch. He can't get up after that. I risked everything. On that single punch. That counter was... It was mine. Huh? The rain. It stopped. There it is! The red corner has thrown in the towel! Who would have ever predicted this? The mighty, indestructible Jimmy Sisbar isn't even twitching! We just witnessed a major upset! Jimmy Sisbar is defeated! Japan's Ichiro Miyata scores a flawless victory by knockout! He did it, Pyo! He did it! Amazing! He somehow managed to pull it off! Incredible! I knew you could do it! I'm proud of you. A remarkable job. Uh-oh. They aren't looking very friendly in the stands. Maybe we should get out of here. Mm-hmm. Uh, hey! Would you look at that guy? He can barely walk out of here. And he beat Jimmy Sispar like that? It doesn't seem right. But he really did it. That guy's intense. We wound up losing money on the deal, but we witnessed something really awesome. Unreal. I don't get it. It looks like the fans in Thailand aren't so bad after all. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> hey, Ichiro! Congratulations, Ichiro! Oh, well, I guess he didn't hear what I said. <sighs> he smiled! I'm sure of it! I just saw him smile! taking me all the way to the airport. I appreciate it. No problem. After all, I was able to buy this car thanks to you. I was so right to bet on the dark horse. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky you. Guess you're leaving now. Yeah, afraid so. Ichiro, it's time. Let's go. All right, I'm coming. Just give me a sec. Hey, Shauna. Huh? I want you to remember this. This is the secret to throw in a counter. You need perfect timing. And a lot of heart. Things are gonna be very different now. Now that he beat Jimmy, no second-rate fighter's gonna want to challenge him. It'll be harder to find a willing opponent. That's just fine. Bring on the tough opponents. If he keeps this up and steadily defeats them, the world title will slowly but surely come into view. And when it's time to make his triumphant return, Japan's going to get very busy. Damn. Listen to you talk like it's all going to be a cakewalk. Japan, huh? I wonder what Ipo will be ranked at when I get back. Wait for me. When I get back, I swear...